before you consider turning on Aero, you need to make sure that the server itself conforms to some minimum requirements. I'll put these on the website as well. I'm going to add a feature. So if you launch Server Manager, select Features, we're going to add a new feature. So select Add Features. And the one we want is called Desktop Experience. Add Required Features. Next, Install. and it's telling us there's a restart pending. Click Close and select Yes to restart. Now this restart takes quite some time. I've speeded it up considerably. And when you log back in again it will resume the configuration wizard and all being well it should say Installation succeeded. Close. Now we can close down Server Manager now I'm going to want to start a service up, so type in services.msc I'm just going to maximize that so you can see what I'm doing and the service we're looking for is called themes right click it and select its properties and at the moment you'll see it's disabled S change its startup type to automatic click apply and then you can start the service OK, and we can close that down. If you right click anywhere on the desktop now and select Personalize, you'll see that you can enable the Aero theme. And you'll notice from the taskbar and the Windows Surround that we're now using Windows Aero. Don't forget to come and visit us at www.petnetlive.com. Thanks very much.